but for a lot of our athletes, they're gonna wanna try and butterfly their pull-ups. Now the benefit to the butterfly is it's a fast cycle. The disadvantage is that it kinda is a dead end road. Once you learn it for the pull-up, there's really nothing else we incorporate it for as much as we do a traditional gymnastics kit. So it's important for athletes to know both. But if they do wanna learn the butterfly, let's start here. So MDV is gonna be on the bar, and the first thing I'm gonna have him work on is just the shoulder cycle. And I'm gonna have him not have his, use his legs, and just like I do in a kip, I need him to be in control. So check this out. MDV's on the bar, he just kinda thinks about using his shoulders only. Yeah, he's just moving, right? Moving, and if I ask him to stop, he's in full control. Thank you, relax for a second. Our athletes need to understand the cyclical motion of the butterfly pull-up. Once they understand that, step number two is for our athletes to learn this kind of backward bicycle swooping motion. So I'll have MDV just simply hold on to an object and learn that backward bicycle. The fact that his legs kick down and around, right? They don't go the opposite direction, this way. Once MDV understands that, I'm gonna have him jump onto the bar and simply practice this motion so over here with just the feet in this particular position. So similar to what he just did with, the, with his shoulders, now he's just doing it with his legs, that's it. And what I'm looking for as a coach is to have my hand here so the knees don't go too high. They come around and boom, he pulls his feet right back. Once he understands that, I get him over here onto a box. This is something that we're trying out for a progression and it's a nice way to incorporate it. I have him simply start off by just working his leg, just feeling his leg. Boom, right? He's thinking about pulling it back, pulling it back, right? Then I say, okay, now that you have your leg, try and incorporate your upper body as well. Check this out. Boom. Start off nice and slow. Feeling the cycle. Feel it. Feel it. Once he feels this, I then transition him over to a bar, and we start low, finish high. So check this out. MDV is going to start really low, incorporating both. Boom. And maybe for today, that's where he stops. But if he feels good, then I pull him all the way up. I get his chin back and he cycles all the way up over the bar. Thank you. For today, guys, this is one progression. The key with the butterfly, take your time. Start here, right? Feel it. And if your athletes are all over the place, have them stop. Take them back, and then develop from there. Have a great workout, guys, and have a great day.